We have a very interesting question from uh, Giamuso. Sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong, Giamuso. He has a very nice surround sound system with a Bryston power amp, Parasound preamplifier, but more importantly, that audio audience, uh, nine, ten, and center speakers. He says he had these more than 20 years, and he noticed that he's losing some treble in these speakers. Uh, so basically, his question is, in the Parasound preamplifier, he can turn up and down the, uh, the bass and the treble. So is it possible to increase the treble to kind of alleviate the, the missing uh, treble from the speakers? And how much can he then turn it up? First of all, it really depends on how loud you're playing, uh, because the, the, treble, um, the treble setting is basically an increase in level at that specific frequency, uh, or basically above a certain frequency, you are, you are increasing the, the tweeter level. So if you're not playing loud, then yes, it's not an issue. If you typically sometimes are playing loud, then increasing the treble will put out more energy to the speakers. So you might damage the tweeters if you overdo it. At the same time, though, the, the treble control increases mostly in the highest frequencies and less in the lower frequencies where you have the most energy. So in the real world, it's typically not really an issue. Um, so, so you could do it uh, to kind of get that, some of that treble back. I would really suggest the best solution here is to replace the tweeters to make sure it, it sounds the best because the increase in treble you're doing from the amplifier might not be at the same frequencies as where the tweeter actually has a problem. One thing that's very interesting in this regard, though, is that when people are worried about burning out tweeters, you know, sometimes it happens that you're playing too loud and, and you're burning your tweeters, so that's that's what he might be afraid of here is it's safe to turn up the treble. But actually what typically burns out tweeters is not too much treble. I know that sounds a little bit weird, but what typically happens is when you're playing too loud, the amplifier is clipping. Uh, and it's doing that because it can't put out the energy that you are requiring for the bass driver. So you want to play a lot of bass, you want to play loud, um, and one point you reach the point where the amplifier can't play any louder. So the amplifier will clip. So instead of doing a nice wave, it will clip the top of the wave. And those edges of that clipped wave is actually at a very high frequency. So now you're taking that bass energy and putting it directly into the tweeters. And then the tweeters will burn up. So this is how tweeters are typically damaged. It's not actually because of too much energy in the high frequencies. It's because of clipped energy in the low frequencies that ends up in the tweeter. That, that's where the problem is. In that sense, you know, it's I wouldn't be too scared of actually damaging the tweeters. It's more a case of it will sound better if you fully replace the triggers instead. <laughs>